Hi, this is Mike with Calculator Genius, and today I'm going to give you an overview of our college GPA calculator. So to get started, we'll just uh, we'll scroll down to the calculator, and uh, under step one, you're going to select your grade scale. So uh, various schools have uh, various grade scales that are in use, so you want to be sure and select the proper grade scale that your school is using. Um, the default grade scale for this particular calculator is the four-point grade scale and basically uh, that's pretty straightforward and A is worth four points, a B is worth three points and, and so on. Uh, there's uh, several variations uh, in here. Um, for example, we'll check out some of the other ones. So this is the four point scale with the plus or minus grading. And so as you can see uh, on this particular one, an A plus is worth four and A is, is for um, A minus 3.7 and, and so on. And uh, we have a very similar one that's uh, to two decimal places. And we have some other ones as well, the 4.3 out of 4, uh, which in this case the A plus is worth 4.33 points. And we also have a five-point grade scale. Uh, if your school is using um, a different grade scale uh, than what's shown here, please just send, uh, send us an email and we will get that incorporated. Um, so I'm going to take this back to the four-point grade scale and we'll scroll down and look at some of the other sections. So step number two is optional and uh, this is where you can enter in your prior GPA. Um, so if you've taken uh, several um, several semesters worth of classes, uh, you know, in the past you can put your, your cumulative GPA. So let's say, you know, you, you had a uh, 3.0 uh, and you've taken 35 uh, cumulative credit hours, so you would put that information in there. It's completely optional, um, and you'll see the result here in just a minute. Uh, step three is where you'll actually enter this semester's results, and um, so you can go in here and let's say your first class, uh, you received an A, and it's worth three credit points. Um, your second class, you received a B, and it was also worth three points. And you can also come in here. These are optional fields, but you could type in history and, and so on. So you enter in uh, your grade for each one of your classes. If you need to enter additional classes, you can just select the Add Course button, and it will give you an additional field here. And you can add as many as you'd like. And we will press the Calculate button, and we'll check out what we have. So. Uh, for this semester, our GPA was a 3.5, and if you average in uh, this semester with the, the cumulative that we've entered in before, um, it will give you your uh, overall cumulative GPA, your new GPA, uh, which is a 3.07 in this example. And uh, once you're done, feel free to uh, you know hit the clear button and clear it back out. Also, um, I'll just note that if you want to delete any of these courses out, you can do that, you can add, delete, and, and so on and so forth. So anyways, I hope that was helpful, and that is how you use this GPA calculator. If you have any feedback, again, feel free to shoot us an email. We, uh, we'd love to hear from you. Thanks much.